Hey y'all, welcome to Holiday Lighthouse. Today we're gonna to try to fix what's wrong with my matrix. As you can see by looking at it, the left-hand side of the matrix is not showing up. I think we have a couple bad pixels. Stick with me while we try to fix what's wrong with my matrix. The matrix itself is built using seed pixels. Each of these seed pixels is being held in place by a 3D printed seed pixel adapter that fits into the 12 millimeter holes that are usually used for the bullet pixels. In order to push all these pixels, it took quite a bit of time to do this prop. So it's 2400 LEDs, took me around four hours to probably get all these pixels in place. Unfortunately, like we said, left hand side's not working. We're gonna have to tear those all out and uh, and replace them. So. All right, so I've spun the matrix around, so we're looking at the back side now. I'm just gonna start pulling out these pixels so we can get the process started of replacing them with the good string that's working right now. So I've gotten the matrix off the wall and onto my couch. I have found that this is the easiest way to push the little pixel adapters into these tiny holes. Here's one of the adapters that we use to hold the seed pixels. They fit right in the middle there. And the top has a lip that goes around the 12 millimeter hole in the matrix portion, and they just snap into place. Now that I've shown you how one of these adapters fits into the 12 millimeter holes, let's get the remaining pixels pushed and complete the window matrix. The matrix itself is powered by a smart receiver and runs off of just four ports. Each port has 540 LEDs on it, and at 30% max brightness, I haven't yet found the need to use any power injection. The matrix itself is set up in X lights with four strings of 540 LEDs each. Each of the strings is exact 12 times to get us a total of 48 pixels wide. Our total height of the, of the matrix is 45 pixels. So 45 times 48 gives us a grand total of 2,160 pixels. Well, all right, we got the matrix back on the wall. Now that we have all new pixels that are working on that left hand side, everything should show up. Let's go over to X lights, hit play and see what happens. With the matrix not working, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you want to see more videos on how some of these 3D printed props were designed and printed and built, please stay tuned and subscribe. Those videos will be coming out shortly. Thank you and happy sequencing.